it's certainly true that much of what we call innovation today is essentially routine or evolutionary innovation. I mean, cloud computing has been around for a long time, right? And it's getting better and better and better. After all, cloud computing is just mainframe computing in a different way, which is how I learned how to compute when I was a young boy. So the fact of the matter is these ideas have been around for a long time. Is that going to change the world? It makes it certainly better, but it's another step in the evolution of computer architecture. There's a new generation of user interface theory that says there should not be a user interface, that it, the information should just be around you. Um, we have a product called Google Now, which is available on Android, which actually attempts by watching what you're doing and with your permission and so forth to make some suggestions. So it's now figured out roughly where I live and roughly where I work, and it tells me how long it takes me to get f back and forth to the work, sort of useful. I didn't ask it to do that. It figured out that I was going back and forth every day, and it said, oh, there's a traffic jam and so forth. Now, what are the limits of that technology? That's an artificial intelligence question. But it's highly useful for it to have made a suggestion that would be, that would be good. So I think we're going to go from these sort of command and control interfaces where, you know, you tell the computer, you know, like a dog, bark. Uh, and instead, the computer becomes much more of a friend. Um, and a friend in the sense that the computer says, well, we kind of know what you care about. And again, you've all given it permission to do this. Um, and it says, well, maybe you should do this or maybe you should uh, do that. And the ultimate hope model is that the computer does what it does well, which is these complicated analytical needle and haystack problems, has perfect memory. And the humans do what we do well, which is judgment and having fun and thinking about things. And that, that the two, the relationship is symbiotic, that the computer is making suggestions that are pretty good, they're pretty helpful, but that you're ultimately in charge.